Hi, this is Dr. Alan Frankel. I'd like to speak to you about the use of cannabis in the treatment of seizure disorders. Many of you have heard about the use of cannabidiol, CBD, for seizures, and we've been doing it here at Greenbridge Medical for approximately five years. Over those five years, we've become much more comfortable with it, and according to our last survey of our last 100 patients treated, have a success rate of markedly decreasing or eliminating seizures in 65% of the cases. This is in contrast to these patients who are already on two pharmaceutical medications and adding a third pharmaceutical with many side effects is not only difficult, but not particularly effective. If you're on two pharmaceuticals, adding a third increases the chance of controlling the seizures by 10%. With CBD, it's over 50%. One other, I think, extremely important point to make, because this is going to become a, a public as well as publicly traded issue in the next number of months. GW Pharmaceuticals, which is a really, um, I think, amazing for a pharmaceutical company, does make whole plant medicines, and now they're making a medicine called Epidiolex, which starts as a whole plant medicine. Everything else is stripped out, and the CBD now, as Epidiolex, is approved for seizures in the United States. If you have a child or an adult with seizures that are not well controlled on typical pharmaceuticals, I would strongly encourage the use of CBD. In addition, THC is effective as an anti-seizure medication, and THC acid is surprisingly effective for seizures that are not being controlled with CBD. And we are now using combinations of CBD, THC, and THC acid in some patients. So hang on, this is a big, big exploding field, not just for seizures, but for autistic children and a number of other neurological conditions. If you would like more information on the use of cannabis in the treatment of seizures, please check out my website or call my office for a consultation.